Hello. <laughs> Welcome back to Spooptober. I don't know. I'm okay. I'm trying. Wait. Give me points. We're trying. Uh, yeah, I did one eye off camera because I found that it goes a lot faster if I do one eye and know what I'm doing first rather than just jumping in and then not knowing what I'm doing anyway. Uh, but it's just like a little spoopy, you know, it's like a tree coming out of your eyebrow and then you got the moon right there and I don't know what this is, but it was in the picture and yeah, it's just spoopy. So the first thing that I did, where's my brush? First thing I'm gonna do is take why is my arm my arm looks like one of those flamingo legs you know how flamingos are like birds just like bend their legs the like they ankle not the ankles they knees the wrong way and then they be walking like this like this no okay but i'm gonna take just take like a flat shader brush or you know whatever brush you have that's kind of flat or your finger it doesn't really matter and going into a concealer and priming the eyelid. Now taking that teal shade right here. And do it lightly at first because you don't want it to be, you can see it's not like too, too vibrant. Lightly dusting that. Okay, and then going into this shimmery blue shade and putting that on the lid and then going back in and blending it out a little putting it up a little higher all the way up into that crease now i'm going to take my nyx jumbo eye pencil in milk and create like the little moon oh jesus christ okay Going into the LA Colors Highlighting Palette into this white shade and then setting that. And now I'm going to take the e.l.f. Intense Ink Eyeliner Pen and work on the tree. Actually, I'm going to line my eyes first. Okay. And now, taking that line up and connecting it to the front part of my eyebrow. You can really do the tree any way you want, because I'm pretty sure any way you do is gonna be better than the way I do it, so you know. <laughs> I'm just gonna go lightly over my whole eyebrow and just faintly draw the lines or the branches of the trees. I'm gonna go in on this side instead of doing that again. I'm gonna go on this side with this gray color right here. And I'm gonna try and make a tombstone. I'm gonna go in, you know, let's go in with gold because I can. I don't know where I'm going with this. Boop, 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 brush it away. There we go, that's an R, right? <laughs> Anyone, please? <laughs> Please tell me it's an R. I'm gonna go in with Bossy and smudge that really close to my lower lash line. Up and out underneath that tombstone. I'm gonna take Main Ad... What? Main Adder? Main man eater they put a space in between man and they put like a space between the e and the t well the e and the a right the e and the, the e and the a. i can't spell and i can't okay you know what <sighs> i'm just gonna blend that a little bit lower and then going in with flamingo and blending that all the way down I look like a like a she banshee or something. Jesus. She didn't have any lashes on. So I'm just going to put a tiny bit 
of mascara and that's it okay so I ended up going with the Ruby Kisses color design custom lip stylings in the shade Bordeaux which is a burgundy color and then going over that with black diamond and it's not black I don't know if you guys can tell but it's not black it's more like a black cherry kind of color that is this look all done of course it's an editorial look you're not gonna go out and be like hey guys on like a Monday morning when you're going to work okay but you know it's an editorial kind of spoopy Halloween makeup look okay Actually, this R, this R is for Richard. His name is Richard now, so Richard. This is Richard over here. So, uh, that is all I had for this video. If you liked it, then good for you. Stop staring at me, neighbor. And I will see you in my next one.